Hello guys, welcome to yet another Wilson 18 tutorial. In this uh, video series I'll be showing you how you can set up and configure uh, Ubuntu 12.04 LTS desktop version as a server. Um, in this I'll be showing you how you can do it as a LAMP server, which is a web server. So that will be the Linux, Apache, MySQL and PHP. Um, so in in this first video I'll be showing you how you can actually make a bootable USB um, so that means that if you wanted to install it onto a desktop PC or a laptop um, you, all you'd have to do is actually be able to boot it off the USB and then you can install it from there so let's get started um, the first bit of kit we're going to need to do this is um, a piece of software called USB installer um, you can actually go ahead and google that or you can check the link from the description below so um, you can google USB universal installer and there's a link right at the top and if you scroll down you can go ahead and click download and once you've got that you can go ahead and run it and once you've agreed you can choose which version you want to install and um, the version we're going to be installing is Ubuntu 12.4 uh, desktop version you can go ahead and download that from Ubuntu's website again the link will be in the description so if you want to go over to Ubuntu and click download choose the desktop version and choose whether you want to use a 32-bit version or, or the 64 and um, if you're not sure on which you can just use the 34 that'll work on all of them um, so once you've done that go ahead and click start download and once that's finished you can go ahead and run the USB universal installer so you can pick the version you want to install which is 12.4 desktop and then you can browse for the ISO in which you've just downloaded once you've done that, you need to pick the drive for the USB you want to install it on. And I'm going to be installing it on I. You can choose to format it. Um, only do this if you want to actually delete everything on the drive. Um, but as I do, I'm going to be formatting it. Once you've done that, you can go ahead and click Create. And click Yes. That should then start extracting the ISO image and putting it onto the disk so that once you want to go ahead and install it, you can install it straight off the disk or off the USB drive. Sorry. So, thank you for watching and um, make sure to check the rest of the playlist and you'll be able to see more videos on how you can actually go ahead and install Ubuntu and then there'll be more videos on how you can actually set it up to run as a LAMP server. Um, there will also be more videos coming later on in the future if you wanted to pop over to Wilson 18 and go to the post for um, future updates and there you'll be able to see a list of everything I plan to be adding to our YouTube videos there will be videos um, on Linux networking, Windows networking, and I'll also be showing you how you can set up things like a Minecraft server on Windows 7, Ubuntu, and maybe a few other things. So um, if there's anything else you wanted to see, just uh, comment below, go over to our website and leave a comment on there, or email in. Um, if you like the video, please make sure you subscribe, um, like the video, go on to our Facebook channel, like us on there and anything else is much appreciated so thank you very much and hopefully i'll see you in the next video